Hi everyone, this is a video of my, probably my favorite store in California, which is Whole Foods. Um, I've spent $226.77 on these items. This is what you can get for $226.77 from Whole Foods. These are just some of my favorite things that I grabbed very quickly just to tie me over. I'm filming this at my friend's house right now where I'm staying as a guest because I'm waiting for my house to be finished. So we just went to the supermarket and got a few little things. So uh, uh, we'll get started here. Okay, I love this toothpaste. I get this toothpaste all the time. Um, after being in Australia for a few months, I've come back to Los Angeles and I've been using the Australian toothpaste. I use, This used to be my favorite over the Australian one. Uh, it's probably a tie actually. I still really like it a lot compared to that one. These are the organic blueberries and organic raspberries. In Australia, they'd be $12, $13 for this punnet. But here, they are $5.99 for the blueberry and $5.99 for the strawberry. So right around half the price you'd pay in Australia. These are some of my, oops, that was bad. Some of my favorite products. I love this Dr. Bronner. I just so happen to have gotten the tea tree gel. Um, normally I buy the other flavor, but um, I got that one. And that's my favorite lip balm in the world. The Dr. Brahma in Naked. Okay, so that's that. Now, this isn't everything, because what's happened is, I, I did this shop about three or four days ago, um, and uh, look, look at this, this is, look at the state of that bag. I mean, it's ripped and everything's, this is not a half-cocked video, but it's like half-drunk, half-eaten video. Um, and that never normally happens, but well, it doesn't, but it has in this situation because life happens, this is what's happened. So half of the stuff is actually missing. I'm going to tell you what is not on this table that I did buy is a small salad. ate it already before I shot the video. I planned it on shooting this video with everything intact, everything nice, but I just was so busy, I couldn't even get to it. So I've had a minute, so that's why I'm literally doing it now. Okay, and then what else is missing is my favorite chocolate bar that I wanted to show you. That's long gone because I forgot to keep the packet to at least show you. So that's gone. I'll have to show you next time. And a hummus that I absolutely love. That's gone because I think I ate that in on the car ride home. Um, forgot to keep the packet to show you. All right, my son got two pizza slices. They're gone. He ate them, like, literally walking out the door of the store. So that was there two for seven dollars or four dollars each from the pizza bar and I did get two raspberries but my son ate one so now we're down to one and I got the freshly squeezed orange juice which is my favorite I am disappointed about this because I did want to show you the nice bottle of what it was and everything um, I got the smaller size for seven dollars I normally get the twelve dollar bottle the big one but I just got the small one and it's gone I yeah, that, just forget that. It's gone. All right. Oh, this is my favorite drink in the world. Luckily, I still have one bottle left. I think I brought three of these. I thought they were like $10 or something. But they are um, like $5.99 each right now, and they're on sale. So I got three of them, which was $18. But oh, the lighting's a little jacked. I'm going to do my best. Pineapple power. Oh, this is okay. Let's see what all right. Pineapple power. Normally, okay, we're not having as much success. It's pouring rain today here in California, and I just can't get the lighting right. Um, okay, so the ingredients normally this zooms in beautifully. Today, I'm not having that happen. So, this is just filming this on my son's ex because it's easy but the bottom line is the ingredients is simply organic pineapple organic apple and organic melt mint rather and it's the most refreshing beautiful drink in the world I used to buy it all the time 
um, when I lived in North Hollywood and it's so good. It was like $10 back then, but I don't know. Okay, so we got, we got three of them, but I only have one to show you. Um, next is an avocado hummus sandwich that's missing from this table because uh, I could almost blame kids for this, but I'll, I perhaps won't. The sandwich got dropped to the street in Van Nuys and it just wasn't retrievable. So that sandwich ended up in the bin. We never got it. $7, not on the table, not eaten. Shame, uh, just a shame on that. Okay, told you about the toothpaste. Got that. Told you about that, told you about that. All right, let me think. All right, this mango. <laughs> okay, I had two of these. These are really good. I had two of these mango juices. Okay, this lighting is horrific. Oh, gosh, let's see here. All right, two of these mango juices. And um, just have to bear with the lighting. They're really good. Just, I had two of them. Organic mango. All right. Okay, organic mango juice, organic apple juice, organic lemon juice. So that's all good and well. Had two of those. My son drank one. We're down to this now, this size. I'm going to apologize for lighting. I'm not happy with it, but it is what it is at this point. Okay, what else? Okay, um, that's, that's it that I had to tell you about, I think. I haven't had this one before. I've had this brand, but I got this because I love, I really love this brand. It's my favorite. They used to have these different ones, which were these, but in different packaging, like chocolate chip and all these other flavors. Couldn't find them when I went there. So now this is the one I have. Um, so I have that. I got that. Okay, I got two of these. I wonder if I could got time to fix this lighting. Let's see if this is gonna work. If not, okay, maybe that's a bit better. Maybe it's not. Ugh. Okay, well, we have an issue at hand with that, but whatever. I'm just going to keep going because time is of the essence with this right now. All right, this half chewed video. All right, okay, so got these for my son. He loves them. Um, I've got the cereal in Australia, it's like $10 a box. I don't know how much they are. By the time I look on the receipt and find it, it could be a while, so we'll just move on. Probably I'm going to guess like $4 a box, something like that. Okay. Brought these potato chips for my son. Oh, he got them. He just searched the shop and found stuff he wanted. They're opened. So here we go again with that. Um, okay. These are $5 each. This is $10 for these gummy pandas. I used to buy these all the time, but went back to Australia for a couple of months and... Um, they didn't have anything like this, so that's the ingredients. It's just like a healthier gummy if you're going to have one. Okay, I love these so much. Um, I brought two packets. One is half opened. The other one is still intact. And they are just like an M&M or a Smartie in Australia. Um, and sort of organic-y kind of ingredients. Better version, of course, because this is Whole Foods, my favorite shop. Oh, this, honestly, this is an empty packet, ate them all before I could, um, okay, so I did go to the shop three days ago, because I think I had like two or three of these a day, and it was for like three days, but anyway, this is really nice, it's like a little, I don't know, I call it like a, I don't know what it is, but it's like a little thing, it's sort of like this one, they're really nice, coconut cookies, okay, you want to call it a cookie? Um, and that's the ingredients on the back there. We're going to coconut, la 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 la, Himalayan salt, I'll let you guys read it. All right, that's that. I just got these when I got the sandwich. I had high hopes for that sandwich. I was starving. I was running through the town all day like a crazy woman doing a billion things. All I wanted to do was eat this sandwich that I was so excited for. Dropped, done, ruined, destroyed. So no sandwich eaten and these are the chips, but I was going to actually perhaps eat these with the sandwich, but they're still here. <sighs> okay, what have we got here? This is like, I used to eat this all the time. It's just a little canola quick meal. I don't put it in the microwave because I don't like microwaves. I don't use them. 
I just feel like they change the molecular structure of the food and it, it just doesn't seem worth it. I, I just would put it in a saucepan and heat it up or do something, I don't know. But anyway, I don't know if it's organic that one, but I just used to eat it because it's very quick. Um, this is like the type of thing I love. Um, it's a rock and roll truffle, organic superfood. I, I love to eat these kind of things. Um, well, that's a little better. Uh, okay, so just everything with the little asterisk is organic. So date paste, cacao nibs, cacao powder, cacao nectar, goji berries, cinnamon, spirulina, ginger. Oh dear, I'll have to cope with that because I don't like ginger. Most people do, I don't. Cognac pepper, all right, well, I didn't read down that far. I just grabbed and went because I only had a minute. I literally just told my son to grab everything he can in the supermarket and let's go. So we did this very quickly. But if I had a red ginger, I probably wouldn't have got them. But now I do have them, I'm gonna eat them and actually forget about the ginger. This is my favorite drink in the world. I got six of them. All right, those two were full, but these four I kept the bottles so this video could be a little more realistic as to, so you could see what I got, but they're empty. Um, this is my favorite drink in the world besides that mint drink I showed you earlier. This is like a chocolate rishi, it's like a mushroom drink. Um, my son poured it for me one day and it had like these, <laughs> like these, I don't know, white chunks of mushroom. We went through a lot of stages with this company when it first sort of came out, like, um, I guess they were getting their little recipe down pat but it's perfect now it was kind of had chunks in it before like white dead mushroom but not really I don't, okay I don't want to say that because this is the best drink in the world and I don't want to put people off because it's not like that it's just I was drinking so many of them a day that I was like a bit of an expert on them and one particular batch had that but it doesn't matter it's the best drink ever I waited so many months to get this drink again I just want to get it in Australia but it's not there so all right this is an edible cookie dough my son's little pickup that he put in the trolley ready to eat cookie dough edible to say easier version health wise I guess because back again to the ingredients and that's what it is okay um okay these I've never had before I just saw them because I have been gone a few months overseas and I the shops pretty much the same but they've had a few little bits and pieces in that are different like when I left that packaging was back the original these have stayed the same most of the things have stayed the same except I haven't seen these before organic um, these are the kind of things I just get to eat for breakfast <sighs> let's see um, yeah whatever where's the ingredients under here Okay, it's pretty much all organic. I'm not worried about it. It's really good. I, I know they'll be fine. Okay, I just grabbed that. Haven't had it before. Eaten it. The box is here, but I wanted to keep the box to show you before I throw it out. Um, I liked it. It was good. It is what it is. Spinach ricotta lasagna. Okay, my son. This is his meal. He got these. He likes them. We got two of them. He got two of these, but one of the boxes got thrown out by my friend. I was going to keep it, but I guess she threw it out. I could only find one. Um, you know, they are what they are, they're fine. Little snack. Um, this is my favorite brand in these kind of frozen food things. So, like, um, I love this Amy's, it's called Amy's, and this one's probably my favorite Amy's Indian. You cannot get it literally in Australia, they do keep this Amy's, but they keep the worst possible version like they keep the flavors and the ones I don't like like the worst ones that like the, the best ones are over here like they're everywhere you can get them all the time get them at Target Whole Foods Ralph's everywhere um, this one's probably my favorite I love it this is still intact I haven't eaten it um, that's the ingredients and oh what do we have here my son's beef jerky because he's a little meat eater and okay he's opened this and it's the beef jerky I don't buy this in Australia because they don't have an organic version that I have found even in our store that is similar to Whole Foods it's nothing compared to Whole Foods it's just like such a little mum and pop corner store that anyway that's the ingredients on that of course not ideal but better than 
not organic of course this I think this is the last thing I have to show you um, this drink here is my backup drink if this one is not available but um, I got it because I saw it on the shelf first before I saw that one actually so I thought yeah I'll get that and, and I just didn't take it out of the cart I just kept it and got it but basically hopefully it's all good um, ingredients okay here we go well most of it's organic and yeah whatever it'll be fine it's I like it I like it I yeah I, I like it second compared to that one uh, is that everything okay that's everything for now and remember I do have the missing items on my receipt here and that's about it for this video I'll do another Whole Foods food haul later when I get more time and more organized and it won't be as half chewed up as this one was. Anyway, have a great day. Bye.